So I wanted to share another video about um, how to daisy chain power supply units together. And this is really important to have. Um, you can search on Amazon power supply daisy chain and it should come up. It's only 10 bucks. So this is important if you're running, if you need more than one power supply unit, uh, PSU. So I have one power supply right there and I have one power supply right there. So these two 5080s are on this power supply. This power supply is running the motherboard, the CPU and all that stuff. Uh, this 5080 Founders Edition and this 3090. And you're probably wondering why I have a 3090 in there, but it's actually better for AI because it has more VRAM. This is 24 gigabytes uh, VRAM versus 16. But anyways, um, lost my train of thought here. Okay, so basically what you do is you connect from this with a Molex connector, which is right there. And I have one connected right now. So it's plugged in at this spot, right? On this, okay, from the original PSU. And then you have the second PSU, um, the motherboard connector. And you plug that into this one right here. Now, the importance of daisy chaining like that, it's so... Okay, so if you didn't have that connector, like this connector, then this is always going to be on. <clears throat> this power supply, the additional power supply, it's always going to be running. And you don't want two GPUs running 24-7 and then trying to connect to, let's just say you have your computer off, right? These are still going to be running because you, you don't have the daisy chain. So that's the power of this daisy chain adapter uh, is basically this power supply tells that power supply, I only want you on when I'm on and when I'm off, you're off too. So it makes a huge difference. It's very important. It's only 10 bucks. So if you ever get into a situation where you need to daisy chain power supplies, I thought I'd drop this knowledge that I learned um, about this. But yeah, it's only 10 bucks. Well worth it.